eat grain. Have grain. Drink Pepsi. No, wrong game. Still, lack of metal and lack of metal goods. And this is good and bad, mostly bad, but uh, there is an invasion of all the cities around here. So I'm going to prepare for that by making sure that he has nothing to rob from me. I mean, there'll be some, but I can't be bothered to go and minima, uh, micro that. All right, finally, fish. Mm, I see you there, rip and pirate too. We got a quest for that. Not seeing anything about uh, about somebody sending out these pirates. So get on it. Where did he go? There we go. Now he did attack somebody else, so I just want to make sure that there's no missions to take it. Because if if you find a mission from somebody who's agitated and wants you to destroy some pirates, then you can get a free boat off of it. And it's the best boat available. So for me that would be a Hanseatic. No, a, car a Carvel in fact, which is amazing. I always want for boats. What are you researching, Jake? Um, River Cog, but it should be done by now. I turned off notifications, so it's probably not going to give me a little video about it, which is a crying shame. So let's go to Riga, and... We're not doing anything, so we can change that to a three-field system. We've got all the boats. I don't care about naval battles, I don't care about defensive structures, because I just allow myself to be pillaged. I don't know what Founding Cities does, but it probably finds a new city for you. I'm not very interested in that right now. But uh, production, yes. Cuts basic costs for growers in half, yes. Happy days results in more money for moi. So, how about people move over there? The lovely thing about Harlem is I don't particularly need all these people. I mean, sure, they're making me some fish, but... Oops, that was... Oh well, beggars won't arrive from that. Hopefully I didn't just cull people because of that. Uh, because of that. We've all seen enough people culling in this game. More people for Helsinki. Am I sure it's Helsinki that I want to do? Well, why not? Okay, so I do have the metal tools there. They're just not getting around. They'll be one of my stopped fleets right now, which in this case will be Malma to uh, Alborg tools. Get on it, there are plenty of tools right now. How about pitch? Yeah, there's never really any pitch flowing, which is a damn shame. Oh boy. Destroy pirates, one free carvel? Yes. You don't really get missions much better than that. A free carvel. Not only that, I get all the boats from uh, what I destroy here. So I already grabbed a, uh, a hulk. Now I will supplement that with a cog. Jake, turn on the smokehouses again, didn't I already? Pretty sure I did. If I didn't, then I culled a lot of people here. Uh, I didn't cull a lot of people. No, but this is bad. I'm actually in recession right now, so people are... 1% conversion per day burgers into uh, beggars, so that's terrible. Oh well, people mover is moving people. But I should probably move them to Boston right now. So that I can pick up more of them quickly. What a, oh man, more pirates. I 
I don't want all those people to just disappear. Oh, I never brought over those goods for that assignment, did I? Helsinki. Well, 400,000 that I'm not going to see again. Can't cry over it. I'll pick up the rest of those beggars, though, and not have them go to waste. I'll put them into other cities. Hunter, please. What the heck? This is a nice fleet. Hulks and hulks. Not only that, but freebies too. Yeah, this population is dying. I gotta, I gotta deal with them fast. Uh, what? <laughs> Organized between Hunter 2 and Hunter 2. Why? I wonder if there was a way to duplicate votes by doing that. So there we go. The population of Harlem has taken a nasty turn, but at least I've been able to abduct them and take them to a better place. And yeah, they're still under attack. That's a shame. It's a damn shame. But over to Helsinki they go. When doing this manually and without using the uh, cheatery chokeries, it's a really good maneuver with your fast ship to travel down the center of the enemy ships and let out two barrages of the chain shot. Just the damage you do with that is pretty intense. Because every time you hit them on their masts, well, they go slower and you go proportionally faster. The last of what I have to deal with should be around here. There we go. And yeah, well, let's stop in by Cologne, because I never go here. I got nothing for me, and... Nothing for me. I'm certainly not about to lend money to some guy from Cologne. You'll never be fighting river cogs on rivers because river cogs cannot be upgraded with uh, with guns. Tragic, I know. I can, however, wait. Was there another pirate there? God knows how long these pirates have been hanging around. How are you doing, Jake? Just fantastic. Will you show us the pains of using caravans, Jake? Did that once before. It was horrible. We might do it in the future, but I have no great desires to. Alright, nice. Free ship. Free, amazing ship. And Hunter returns to Grun again. Now, where was Wildcard Thagnus again? I always lose track of that guy. And then there's the Helsinki uh, tailors that I need to get rid of because we're not doing that. But that mission will probably pop up again since clothes are still very much in demand. So we also got all this metal that I need to bring back. That might be a use for one of these Carvels that I've got. Or a Hanseatic Cog, whichever strikes us as more useful. Because we got a shortage of iron, that much is true. And I produce 60 a day, 600 every 10 days. I think one Hanseatic Cog can take care of this. And this will be Hell to Alberg. 
metal. And what name do we have coming in? We've got a lot of names here. Why tips matey? I have no idea. And I can't fit it in. Mm. Tips matey. Alright, it's a 10 day haul as well. That's pretty handy for us. So when you're in Helsinki, load all that iron. When you're in Alborg, unload all that iron. Rinse and repeat. Metal. That doesn't answer the cheese question though, because I want that cheese flowing as well. We don't have a lot of it right now. We will, but not right now. You produce cheese so slowly. Half the speed of the uh, metal. Harumph. And these guys really seem to be struggling with lack of goods anyway. Oh well. We're okay as we are. Now the population of the Hansa overall is growing pretty big because I keep dispersing the people from Harlem. There we go, more Dutch beggars into Helsinki. Helsinki is now two-thirds Dutch. You can thank me later. And back to Harlem you go. Little worried, but now the, uh, the number of beggars will increase once more. I'm going to help out with that by hosting a meal for the poor which should really surge up the amount of people. Stagnation has no effect, but I keep this place so well uh, supplied with goodies that they should be... Well, people should be pouring in, really. Economic refugees. No way. No way do I want that in Harlem. Harlem is stacked with these goodies, though. Which tells me I could probably turn down the production in favour of getting more people working in the smokehouses. Just a little at least. There we go. Hmm. But that tells me that probably some of my stopped ships could start up again. Rostock Alberg Grain. You probably stopped because I abducted all the grain from Rostock. Well, I assure you, it is back. Who else? The Boston to Alberg salt man, because there wasn't enough salt here. Well, there certainly is now, so get to it. The Bergen to Alberg wood. Yeah, Bergen's pretty much stopped doing the whole wood affair, hasn't it? So you can stay stopped. Not my main uh, main place for wood anyway. Boston also not so big on the brick anymore. Scat Alberg wood, but uh, Scarborough should have plenty of wood. It does get to work. You know, I could probably just go around all these ones that have stopped and just tell them to start again. Why no hotkeys? Uh, Nevstead produces metal, right? Yeah, quite a bit of it, but not so much that you're going to actually get to work. The Riga, yeah, Riga doesn't produce hemp anymore, so let's not worry about that. Riga also doesn't really produce brick. It got rid of a lot of things in favor of the cheese. The honey production and, you know, that pitch will probably turn itself off soon enough. Alright, I'm happy enough with that. Economic refugees are fun. Yeah, they were good for you, but I like to think that people don't uh, live such bad lives in my hands uh, that they need to become refugees. 
All right, so the mood has probably improved over here with Flanders considerably. Let's give him some tribute instead. He wants clothing and meat, like 40 of both to be safe. I don't have clothing nor meat for him, so I need to grab something. Not sure if the wild card is really suited for this. I could grab instead, uh, hmm, you'd make another fine wild card, but no. Hunter would be able to take care of that. And Hunter already has tons of stuff and too many boats as is, so... Ditch the Hulk. Ditch the goods. Especially the metal goods. Man, I keep Lubeck really well... Uh, really well supplied. What can Lubeck do for me? Honey, I guess. Cloth, I'm not so concerned about that. We already have that, and these goods come in plenty as is. You could bring plenty of honey to the world. Or I could just keep you for something I can build up later on, which also works. Still, I need meat and I need clothes, was it? Hell, I can bring these clothes over to somewhere that matters anyway. Still need that meat, though. Uh, Alberg will have meat. Not a whole bunch, but it's got it. So tribute is a nice mission to get with the uh, the lords because yeah why exactly it gives you twenty if you fulfill it and as long as the lands you keep uh, fairly well supplied then it's no real big deal to do so there we go he's even happy I could give him that money and he'd be on top of the world but it would be a bit of a waste hunter get back to Lubeck where you belong starvation has been stopped thankfully ah oh, man Boston just can't get the grain. London, grain, Bruges, grain, Harlem, grain, but Boston always suffers for it. They're hungry. They're so hungry. They're so salty. And God, have they got a lot of clay. Well, I have a lot of money, so I need to think where I want to build up. Is Helsinki built up sufficiently for me? No. Housing occupancy is getting dangerous. Well, wildcard Thagnus, we've got jobs for you now. I want you to grab Boston's clay. Harlem is starting to get over the limit as well. Maybe I really need to slow down all this production and bring up the smoke houses. Bring them down to like 50 or so. 40 maybe. And then back up. I think that's because, didn't I kill Harlem's uh, brick and grain trains? Harlem. Brick, less than three. Yeah, you're not active. Harlem wood. Yeah, you are active, but they make a lot more wood than that. But it makes a good place that I can actually go and stop by for these resources. And since it's such a big place, I have no problem building up extra warehouses for them. Except there's not really much space here, but still. That'll give me another 16,000 capacity. But why... why is... Boston giving me so much brick? I should have somebody taking care of that. Boston salt. Boston brick. 1,500. Boston produces a lot, like let's say 3,000 every 10 days. This takes 8 days, so I need someone else doing the Boston Alberg brick. Or I just need you to be bigger. Yeah, I think you just need to be bigger. Boston, however, has no boats available for me actually, I thought it might. What a shame. Boss to Al, Brick. I'll just set up another uh, 1500 or so capacity to do that. Oh, would you look at that? We've got a couple of Hanseatic cogs just asking to do it. Boston to Alberg, Brick, and 
Uh, not seeing any names here, though. Well, I mean, we have plenty of names, but no new ones coming in. I think we'll go for Fury, though. Yeah, I can't go wrong with a couple of them. The bricks have to flow. Get to work. Happy days. Very happy days. Except, where was my wild card? Thagnus, you got work to do. And I'm starting to think I could do with your capacity being even bigger by now. A couple of cogs will help out with that, bring us up to 9,000. I mean, 6,000 clay and 3,000 wood every time you do this kind of thing. You can also help out Scarborough by taking care of those. I'm from Groin again, Jake, says the Flying Dutchman. I'm sorry to hear that. Shortage of mead, we need more, okay, that probably means I'll get a mission for doing mead somewhere that does it. Malma Al Alberg. No, you just want more mead because you're greedy. Well, who isn't? I'm also going to repair this fleet when we get to, uh, to you know where. Da -da 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 -ba -da -da. Doesn't like uh, precise numbers here, I see. Okay, onwards to Scarborough to get the wood. And then away we go. All the way to Helsinki, where I get you repaired as well. Jake, did you say there's a reskin of Port Royale? Other way around, really. Uh, okay, let's help you out a bit with your city advancement, because I want to build some bigger and better things here. How about Riga? You got money for me? Yes, sir, they say. I'm actually going to drop the tax rate a wee bit for poor Riga, because it means in dark times they have trouble actually producing stuff for me. Since the cheese is a little subsidized, I could probably activate both of these. Or at the very least, get some clay going. Just a little bit of clay. Alright, now back you go. What else is there? I swear I upgraded somewhere else. Yeah, you need a, uh, a minister there. It's fine, I can flaunt some money for it. But there's also Scarborough, who also needs that. So that's going to be expensive on the metal goods, which I finally produce a bit of. Thank God. Never thought I'd see the day. Scarborough's looking fine, it just needs more population, really. And maybe some diversification of the goods it produces. Honey is an idea, but I'm not sold on that right now. How are we looking on goods centrally, though? Is there anything we're bursting with? No, and that's good news. The grain supply is coming up Millhouse. The hemp supply is coming up Millhouse. If anything, I could always do with more hemp. That's a given, though. I mean, you can never have too much hemp. Iron I'm also short on, but Riga should be helping out with that. And then there's the meteries, which I don't even know why are around. Just so I have some meat, I guess. Yes, all is pretty well then. Oh, but Flanders, I made him happy, so... Support for land commercial route. He wants honey, beer, and hemp. It just so happens we're short on honey and beer. Hmm. Didn't think I'd be short on beer, but honey? Lots of honey, lots of beer. Honey, beer, and hemp. Where can I grab some extra beer from? And some honey for that matter. And I think London has answered both of our questions. I just need someone to do it. 
and the next expeditionary fleet is in position to do exactly that. Don't mind me, London, I'm just taking all your goods. <sighs> oh, that's because I've been selling it to the, uh, to the people here. Don't mind me, I'm just going to buy it all back. Okay, so... He will then allow every trader to use a new land route in the region of Flanders that runs from Bruges to Nimwegen. Done. Now what does that mean? It means very little actually. It means that Bruges can now follow this road. Waste of time you might say, and frankly you'd be right. You'd be very right. There's old Slappy but there's my other expedition, right? Right? Yeah, the DDR blind has some goods for us. Good chunk. Alright, good. I can stop by there, you might have more for me. It's all about keeping these guys happy, and then they do so much for you. Wig. Ooh. The Isle of Riga spies some goodies but I don't spy where that attack was. I do, however, see Holgersson out there at Novgorod. Nobody asking me to defeat him, so it's not a big deal, but... Honey would be perfect. That's a shame you have no goods to actually uh, make stuff. Still going to sink Holgersson. He'll just become a bigger problem. Where's the... Aha. Uh -huh. Here's Lutruk for noticing that the pirates were indeed in Danzig. Done and done. Very nice, he's got a Hulk for me as well. Never, never against fighting Hulks in, uh, in this, because damn, they're, uh, they make great addition to my trading fleet despite being upgraded. And I'll have a lot more boats to actually send to uh, Aalborg for turning into trade fleets soon. Which is another thing that makes me quite happy. Thank goodness repairs don't cost resources, imagine that. Not sure I want to imagine that. Goodies. Alright, Helsinki, I am here. Also, you're upgrading everything. Wait, didn't I just choose to do that? You strange game. We want a mint. Generally always want a mint. We want a uh, chapel. No, we actually don't. But we do want a covenant school, because that can be upgraded to a university. And didn't I already... Yeah, I already built the biggest of walls. People should learn from me how to build blooming walls. I mean, wow, they want to run away. This is bad news. Helsinki needs to be repaired. And by repaired, I mean uh, a lot more houses. Because these Dutch people don't like being near other Dutch people. Okay, doesn't give me any particularly good places to build from here because this is where the original wall was and there's always this horrible block on putting buildings where they were. Fortunately though, all this stuff is pretty gridded, so I can just... Wait, the wall isn't done. That's the problem. I mean, they'll still let me build it there, right? Yes and no, mostly no. 
Interesting. This wall is taking its sweet time. And it's only halfway there, so it's going to be ages until it's finished. That's a shame. The AI is probably going to get an opportunity to build buildings that, during that time. As long as I keep uh, occupancy down, though, it should be okay. <laughs> 